last year with the leaves that were fairly wet in the gutters and they were just like piles, like a solid, like a couple inches, like, what, what did you say, like three or four inches thick? So pretty good. And, and they, they were wet. Out. And it was just blowing it's straight up onto the ice. And I mean, there was just a couple leaves left. It was amazing. So if you're going for, I'd say it's on the cheaper side. If you're going for it, I would go with this one. It's a grape, brioche floor. I'm saying that correctly. It's really good. Christian, next item. So we have the Black and Decker trimmer. It seems kind of funny, but Black and Decker is amazing. I love that. It's good. It also has this wheel here, which helps you edge. This, this button here, here, hold on, lift it up. It spins around because it has a regular, it has a two piece of trigger. So you can edge like this? Go on the sidewalk and uh, finish it the other way. They're charging right now. We have a little charging center in the garage. And then, let's say, you're just like, oh, let me trim. You go, hmm? Around like so. And then you can go like trim. Hmm? So, also, I, I recommend this. Right it's very, it's a, it's very powerful. It does a very good job. Uh, from our, uh, from what we've seen so far, it's very good. And also, also, right it's here, not like, it's you not can adjust the size of it. So. It's very cheap on the, uh. It's on the very cheaper side of the sixty dollars or something like that. It was forty-five or something. Yeah. It's really cheap, but I'll show you this. So we got um see what we It's in here. It's got like a three pack of the string edition. It was like five bucks. It was pretty good. It's a pretty good deal. Well we're in here, let me show you everything. So right now we have a charging station. And here we got Those are not Toro. 
But our lawnmowers, we are get, we are content with what we have. These are really nice. So this is the second one. This one has worked out really good. We've had it for like it also actually two years. Got it, um, You guys have no idea what we're talking about, but like all these stories have taken place. Okay, so we. Yeah. Our. We all. But. That middle area with no houses. The black chooses. Who mows that each year? So it takes a long time, but it's worth it. We get a lot for it. So it's really nice. Laps. Um, yeah, but okay. Thing was, or the rear bagging system was right here. Um, you had to put a plug in. Well, this has a built in plug that closes it with this. Now, there is one little, one really little issue with this mower, and that's um, on this and top, there's like this little gap right here, and a little bit of grass is You know, it's a big deal, it's a little bit of grass. No one cares. So, but it worked out just fine. Uh, the car wondering where the bag goes. If you were wondering how the side thing goes in, it goes in through this thing. watching this. It was the day before Easter. When we bought this mower, let's go. This thing... It was so cool that the one forklift couldn't even handle it. They had to get a special one. That's awesome. Let's move on. So, just to make you guys... I'm just going to stall a little bit. So, um, yeah, we went to Home Depot today. Home Depot, awesome. Depot, 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 Depot. That's where most of this puppets come from. Yep. Nice yeah. 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 So, this is kind of cool because this is the one mower that we bought. This is what we bought with our own money. And the other two we didn't buy with our own money are bought the one. The other one, uh, yes. So that was kind of. This is the biggest first mower you purchased. And it's also eh, the shush, first mower shush, 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 shush. made by Toro. Shush. <laughs> so that gives you an idea what it is. Shush. I was. Yeah. Let's just say I researched for 20 yes, minutes. Credit. I researched for so long. Just to find it. Find it. Because we kept using these 22 inch things, and then I'm like, I gotta upgrade here. Hey, you didn't want, you were in this, you don't know the story? Hey, shh, 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 We're both like, um, I think we should upgrade from a push mower, which works, and, you know, we're keeping this one for this year. Shush! 
shut. Sh so I was like, hey, I need I need to look for a bigger mower. So I was just like, hey, why not look Home Depot? And I p typed in expensive mowers. <laughs> and the first one was this one. So I was like, let's get it. And it was 30 inches. Biggest mower made by Target. It actually took longer than that. It wasn't that, but it, that, that sounds cool. So let's just say it's right here bro it's the toro super recycler oh, god beam it is the my opinion the best mower ever made by toro that's a question time master yo son so we got the time master yeah this thing is sweet it is a beast hey hey push it up the back just so you guys know if you don't think this is cool at all I meant, I meant lift it up so lift we can show, no, pull that out, pull the bag out. Ready guys, this is about to show you awesomeness. This is boss guys, look at that. Two blades, two stinking blades. You don't see that much. Isn't that sick? This is awesome, this thing is just, doing something which I have no clue what it is. Oh, just end our Toro lineup. This is not a mower. I'm not sure. Just guess what it is. Well, anyway, right here, personal pace thing, it works without the blade engagement. Alright, this thing goes back. Uh-oh. Oh no, why is it not working? Um, you pull this back and that's how you engage the blade. Okay. Oh, crap. What, already you it, bro. See this blue lever? You see that? Right there? It's a bark. You can't engage the blades without knowing. So, pull that back, and then you can pull bling the back, which I can't do because it's not turned on. So that's actually how you do it. So, obviously, you pull that where you're not kind of like, well, I just stop, because on regular mowers, you and your release the uh, little bar right here, and it turns off. Oh, crap, now how do you turn it off? You got to off all the gas. No, 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 no. This little button right here. See, this is actually a review, something I was looking for. When I was looking at the time I was like, how do you turn it off? How do you turn off the stinking machine? If I'm gonna get it and it's gonna be like a thousand bucks, what am I spending a thousand bucks on if I can't turn it off? Well, my answers were finally, my questions were finally answered today. Like we're in, we took it out of the box. Actually, they're not how you turn it off until you open the box. Well, here you go. Stop button. Dun, 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 dun. Right, this thing is so powerful. Just the blade engagement. It's getting big now. So. It is just unbelievable the amount of power on this thing. I didn't even talk about because we were planning on doing another one. But yeah, it's sick, guys. This thing, but how much do you want to put on? Let's just ask Christian a question. Hey, 
you're pushing the, the lawnmower. It's like the lawnmower is pulling you. It's epic. Just saying, this is how much we love Toro, Toro if you don't think we do. There you go, guys, our Toro snowblower. And then, guys, 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 our Lone Ranger in the corner, our craftsman. So good. He's good, too.